God damn, bitch, ready? Where the fuck to be that, man? Man, turn the beat on so I can eat this shit. Okay, okay. You read my mind, Louis. I like that, I like that. Okay, All right, yeah. Okay, okay, I, okay. This okay. is something revolutionary and legendary. Yeah, me. Not only are the greatest rapper alive, greatest rapper dead or alive, yeah, me. I'm the man, how I handle my business Ain't no flex that I got it, cause I know how I get it Slurging hundreds on these hundreds, man, you know how I spend it Pray your hustle, that's the motion, keep that hope and wish it I'm aggressive, man, I'm cocky, ain't no part of me, Timmy I know one day I'ma die, so ain't no scaring me, nigga I won't swim it through these beats, Michael Phelps couldn't catch me I won't race it through these billions, you say, Bo couldn't catch me Why you think they call me ghost, none of these rappers can touch me Why you think they call me phantom, only bosses can push me Only time I'm being sweet is when I eat my girl cookie Hall of Fame when you say my name and the Bobby be rookie. Ain't no slime, but I'm gunning for these hundreds to took it. Stop that guessing how I got here. Ain't no secret, I took it. Ain't no virus stopping Phantom Stadium. You still gon' book me. They ain't never seen a ghost, but I still got him looking. Alright? Hold up. What was all that big boy shit that you said you gon' show us? How you say you found me and you ain't seen me grow up? Keep on venting with that drunken tongue and that's gon' get you towed up. Always spit that TNT. I know my song gon' blow up. Treat my haters like Duce, cause every shot I pull up. You can tie your train to my back, still it wouldn't slow up. Sounds like in my papers, fruity every time I roll up I can cut you on and cut you off, I'm no controller Rappers are like bitches, Caitlyn Jenner and Joanna, man Slide, then I two-step with my paper, that's the money dance I don't think you hatin', I just think you a neglected fan I'm on Diddy head, how I'm out of times, I'm making bands Devil took my leg, God gave it back, I took a stand You can get the back of open palm, and that's from either hand If you touch my girl on my money, yeah, you touch my fam I'ma take it back to 06 when they was going ham Oh, they was going dumb, oh, it was either one if you was looking for a problem, you can get you some When they was down to throw them hands and they was scared to run And if you lost that one, you came back for another one One of a kind and I've been prophesied the chosen one Begin okay. another end, cause in the time it just begun It's okay. always been about okay. where you going, okay. not about where you from Labels want to sign me, I'm gonna need a hundred I'm real estate, I'm setting up Stacks is what I'm setting up Assets, I can't get enough huh? Okay, paper steady, stacking up Grinding with this vampin' life I'm the dust of Dracula Huh? Ain't no lacking when it's cracking When you gotta make it happen Ain't no time for no relaxing, huh? Okay, a lot of niggas dropped out But they still graduated PhD and all this cabin, huh? Okay, speeding in this pussy And I know I broke a limit, huh? I'ma do the dash in this pussy till I finish, huh? Even if I crash, it's okay cause I'm still in it, huh? Had to give a ghost dick, now her soul is licking, huh? Anytime she mad at me, that pussy, I'ma lick her, huh? Think my cousin Jackie Chan the way I always kick it, huh? TJ went to DJ, all this flavor that I'm mixing, huh? Niggas try to match the look and never match my pimpin', huh? That's not even a thing no more. It's just who can make the hardest games to song about killing a thousand people and telling on themselves, selling drugs or whatever. Like either way, it's no no substance in rap no more. It's just I killed this person, I scammed this person, I sold this many drugs. Hey guys, it's Dave again. I'm here with Ghost, and we're about to do the post video interview. There's a couple of things I wanted to ask. Okay, first of all, Daniel, um, it's David. Dang, 
I don't have no problem with the ABC LGBTIQ XYZ community. They don't have a problem with me not having a problem. Then we just get that out there, state that from the beginning. You put a lot of letters in that. But okay. <clears throat> alphabet gang, alphabet gang. I don't got no problem with the alphabet gang. You can't say nothing about the alphabet gang unless somebody in the alphabet gang is in the conversation. If you don't, you cancel. You can't say nothing about y'all or you cancel. People like you who actually see finish. shit from both sides. Them motherfuckers censor, bro. And I don't say full work, I went to public school. We ain't walking the straight line, we was all over the place. Wait, you don't think that that's more of a societal thing than just the homosexual community, though? Cancel for saying everything about everything. You get canceled for saying anything about the alphabet game. Just. Oh, my bad. Well, okay. Right now, the advances of COVID has led us to have a vaccine that we are requiring people, even me and my job field, I've been required to take it. Well, I knew good. that my kids would eventually have to take it. How do you feel about not only people having to take it to keep their jobs, but also kids more than likely having to take it to continue their schooling? Well, if it's airborne, right, why the fuck the whole world ain't got it? The, the vaccine! vaccine. Oh, man. God, man, he went to public school yeah. or something, nigga? The... I'm sorry. I'm not coughing because of the smoke, I'm coughing because I'm sick of this shit. This COVID is some bullshit, alright? <coughs> how the fuck that shit spread faster than AIDS, bro? And how the fuck do we got a vaccine for COVID before they got a vaccine for AIDS? Ain't that some bullshit? Then this shit supposed to be airborne, right? There's more people breathing in air than anything. This is a normal day. That's a normal day thing, bro. We doing this shit right now, breathing in air. Do we have fucking COVID? Now you forcing people to take shots when they just offering to pay people to take shots, giving out uh, prizes, donating shit to people. You get raises at your job, you get promotions if you get a shot, now you'll get fired from your job. The rent going up, they're taking money out your check if you don't get the shot until you forcibly quit because you, you're not allowed to feed your family no more. What happened to uh, freedom? What happened to that? You see more COVID commercials than HIV commercials. How do you feel about this uh, Boosie and Lil Nas X beef? Uh, Daniel, if you ask me. It's uh, David, by the way. Shout out to Boozy. David. Shout out to uh, Lil Nas X. I don't have no problem with either one of them. I just feel like that's propaganda right now. But I know Boosie and Lil Nas X, bro, is being used right now to cover up some shit that's really going on. You got one nigga that rap about murder, violence, drugs, and all this other shit. You got one nigga that's, that's pushing gay. But based on biblical terms, both of them is sins, right? You like get fired, bro. I get canceled if I, I, can I, call I get, get canceled if I buy it. I don't feel like Boosie or Lil Nas X is wrong. I feel like they're doing what the higher ups want them to do. I feel like Lil Nas X and Boosie is doing exactly what the higher ups want them to do, and that's distraction. Come on now, Boosie is a real street nigga, and Lil Nas X he's not, and they're not gonna get into it. You're not gonna see Boosie and Lil Nas X. At the most, it could be some type of corny or some type of diss song. Uh, Lil Nas X ain't really doing that, but just marketing wise, I can see them doing it. Boosie be speaking a lot on um, gay people, but he got a gay manager. I went to the same high school as him, so I don't want to make it seem like I'm cloud chasing speaking on him or saying, but it's like, it's the truth. Like, he just doing what the label wanted him to do. Between the first interview and this one, we spoken on something dealing with homosexuality. Why do you feel like that's something that we need to talk about? Shit, I was going to ask your ass the same thing. Like, shit, why every time we fucking talk about some shit lead to some gay shit? I know you a part of the goddamn outfit gang, but fuck. It's most shit to talk about, you know what I'm saying? I got gay family members, you know what I'm saying? I'm cool as fuck with you, I don't got no problem. My girl over there, she like girl. I like. But you gotta be just as bad as my shorty though, cause we not going for no ugly ones, you feel me? I just wanna know why, is, is every interview gonna lead to fucking something dealing with gay? Buddy? I mean, there are bigger issues, as you said, are going on. I be wondering why the world cares so much about what gay people do when there's most serious shit going on. Kids dying every day, kids getting kidnapped every day, bro. Kids be going through it the worst, bro, and it's like, don't nobody give a fuck. Like, what gay men do, or what gay women do, or what transgenders do, and that shit is weird as fuck to me. As much sick ass shit that's going on in this fucking world, that's what the fuck y'all care about, motherfucking sex lives? I don't know, uh, I don't know why the, why the masses feel like that, but motherfucker, a, a, a base, a person's talent off they sex so I'm like, oh he gay. That nigga Frank Ocean hard. It's like, but when that nigga came out of the closet, it's like he lost fans, people stopped fucking with him. Why, what the fuck does Frank Ocean being gay have to do with this nigga music? That nigga hard. Okay, Young and May, you know what I'm saying? Female wise. Young and May is cold as fuck, bro. Young and May is cold as fuck, but motherfucker would not give her a fucking flowers 
because she a gay female. World, stop talking about them. They wouldn't cancel everybody if y'all start talking about their ass shit. Let their ass be human beings up to how they fucking is. It wouldn't be, you wouldn't be, wouldn't be no fucking problem, shit. Yeah, yeah, that's how I feel about it. That's how I feel about it. My sniper with me, you know what I'm saying? That nigga don't say nothing. That's the coldest motherfucking video, man. Shout out to Tyler Bear, man. Ain't no real tears, so don't shut us down, don't block us. Alright, go. so I think we're we're at the time where we're gonna wrap up the interview. It was wonderful. Yeah, man, you got that time. We'll see you. Next week, around the same time with the next song. I'm sure the fans are like really anticipating that. And the next interview without the ad lib. So, you know, yeah. Yeah. We'll see you next week.